Government, government scientists keeping a close eye on the sun following a series of intense flares that started over the weekend. NBC's Tom Costello covers Space Force, joins us now with more on this, this ongoing solar phenomenon, if you will. Tom, help us understand what this is even all about. Well, it's incredibly cool if you're a space geek like me, right? Space weather forecasters are reporting severe geomagnetic storm conditions on the sun, including at least five strong solar flares since August 10th. And the activity was more intense than initially expected. So we're right now in a period known as solar maximum. And the sun's magnetic field is right now at its peak of an 11-year cycle. It sends out bubbling, shooting streams of plasma that are 400 times hotter than the sun itself. And scientists are expecting that this increased solar activity will, will continue. But the intensity of this flare-up has really caught them by surprise, Craig. So five strong flares since early August. Any idea how this could impact us, us, us mere earthlings here on the third rock? Yeah, that's right. Uh, you know, and Nanu Nanu. Uh, listen, we've seen it in the past, and, and it could happen again, right? Interfering with power grids by surging higher voltages through transmission lines. So power companies are, are taking steps to avoid disruptions. We could also see high-frequency communications affected at high, at high altitudes. So we're talking about GPS and, re, and radio signals that could be, could be scrambled. A and the storms can even increase the Earth's drag on satellites in low Earth orbit. Thankfully, no major problems reported right now. And by the way, the auroras from these storms are sometimes visible in the night sky, even in the summer. Forecasters say we should watch the sky tonight as far south as Alabama, as far west as California. You might see a trace of auroras even here we are in August, Craig. Tom, I just learned so much. <laughs> Tom Costello for us there in Washington. Tom, thanks as always. Okay. We've got so much to worry about here on Earth, and now we got to worry about the sun. We got that too. That was, yeah. real, that was kind of a real science lesson. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day, or click the link right here.